Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Quest for the Hookshot 2. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and since last time, I went ahead and checked back into the uh, Problematic Dungeon to see if the Gold Ring qualifies as one of the quote-unquote ultimate items to get into that last room. It isn't. But along the way, I happened across this place that I had completely forgotten about. So, let's see what this place has to offer before heading back to what I assume is level 7. Ah, uh, we've definitely got something going on here. Is there anything going around here? No. Uh, and I... Okay. Uh, right. Thankfully, the whistle, the whistle spots work as per normal. So what kind of place is that one area? And I should—I really should have known that that direction would have taken me back into the maze. There's really no reason for me not to realize that. Alright, what is this? Ah... Wait, okay, so I... Th I thought there was something odd there. I thought I was hearing something weird. And hey, heart container. Nice. Alright, so I guess with that, I'll see you guys back in the other place. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Where the heck am I? Huh. Okay. So where the heck was that that I just stumbled into that at random? Oh. Well, that was neat. Though, the thought of jumping dark nuts fills me with some measure of dread. So, I can't go into there. Huh. Hmm. Methinks I am missing something. But I'm not sure what. Was there something in that cave before that I didn't get the first time? Let us find out. Uh, 
Oh, uh, that was just the bomb. That was the bomb guy. All right. Okay. Well, that leads me to think that what I need is in the bonus dungeon. It is right there, after all. So, what? This is Pitfall. So, what kind of. Oh my! Um. What am I looking at? Why do I have the feeling I can't block that? Okay, but it doesn't take... It's not durable, I guess. Uh, okay. Oh, it's... Well, I was right about... Well, I don't, I don't think I was actually facing the right way. Oh, my. Well, thank you for... Destroying my, my enemies. Ah, darn you. And there's the map, and oh! Kinda... level 2-ish. Sort of. Okay, at least I can take those guys out from a distance. And the... Okay, can I... Yes, I can! Can I push either of these? No. Well... That will make this phase of things a lot easier. When I can just... Woo. All right, so I need a key to get into there. Glitch! Glitchavin! I guess that's called second of the seven. Uh... Well, this, thanks to my lovely candle, this fight wasn't very hard. And what do I get for you? You got the cross beams. This item makes me rather cross. So all of these scrolls are very wonderful names, I see. Uh... And just got the one left. There we go. So I'm guessing that when... Ah, dang. I'm actually a little surprised that... So did that just not 
get to me in the doorway, or did I actually block that? That is... Oh, boy. Or maybe it just has a really weird hitbox. Ah. Come on. Okay, so that's where I ultimately want to go. Oh, but no, no, no. I can, can I can stun things, can't I? Assuming I. There we go. Of course, I'm not safe from those things in the doorway. Fair. Uh, of course, I have to f fight things over again. have to be careful not to be in line of sight to those things. Since that appears to be what causes the, uh... The other things, I don't know. I don't really need to fight these things, since I already opened the way. Okay. You know, it worked before, it'll work again. Assuming I can actually get the shot off before getting hit. Alright. So that guy is out of the way. Alright, so I'm guessing key, maybe? Or secret passage? That works too, and can I get that? Yes, I can! Okay, so I can't really do anything here. Alright. At least this was a wide open room. And I'm guessing... Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Ah. Alright, so I can go... Oh, it goes all the way across. Okay. Okay, that's one. And that's two. Haha. -ha. 
Epi! Third of the seven! Okay. Uh, I have arrows, so this seems to be the best way to go about this for the moment. Somehow I'm getting the feeling that I should have, that this one, in the grand scheme of things, this one should have been done before the, the, uh, V, 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 but. Oh, well. And what do we have here? You've got the Pearl Beam. You're beaming with joy. Of course I am. Oh, that stupid thing again. And arrows don't work on you. Uh, can I get to you from here? No, but you... can get to me. Uh... Okay... I'm guessing I have to push the block that's right next to you. Yes. And there's a key. Oh. And that's how the red candle works in side scroll. Neat. Alright. We. I'm guessing this is going to be where the boss key is. I am so glad I have this thing. And that I'm remembering to use it. So, I'm... Given the established pattern, if it can be called as such, from the last one, the last one gave me the gold ring. It stands to reason that this one would give me the uh, level 4 sword. And if that's the case, then it also stands to reason that that's what I'll need to get into level 7. Oh, hello. Uh... That Dark Knight is going to be a nuisance. It needs to go... There we go. Ah! Thank you, fairy! And I guess it, this is going to be fourth of the seven. Rust Dorm, fourth of the seven. And I appear to be making a mockery of this. Yep, I am definitely making a mockery of it. Ooh. Infinite Quiver. As if I didn't have infinite arrows to begin with, now it is official. And... You've got the Shining Duality Blade, also known as the Maester Sword. It deals twice as much damage as the Fairy Sword. Swing it with A. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm 
presuming that that's everything from here, yes. Okay. So I was right in that this... That is a neat looking sword beam though. Very cool. So yeah, level 4 sword. Or Maester Sword, whatever. Uh, and I'm under the presumption that this is what is needed to get past here. Yes, it is. And is this level 7? No! Let's play Tower! Okay! Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> this should be an interesting trip. I'm guessing, yeah, that hurts me. Uh, yeah, that, sorry if that blew your eardrums out. That was basically my computer telling me that today's video just got retweeted. Uh, uh, was there? I, no, I couldn't push any of these. Not from this direction, anyway. Wait, can I? No, I couldn't get around that way. Uh. So this still kind of begs the question. It's been a while since level six. Well, maybe not literally a long time, because this... But... Ah, so what? Ah, you read the inscription on the base of the statue. If you look closely, the statue has the word gullible written on it. When you lean in to look, the statue squirts you with water. Fair enough. And, oh dear. Uh, um, actually, I think this might be a good spot to stop for now, before I get in too deep, or too tall, or whatever. So, I guess, join me next time when I... You continue exploring this place and see what it has for me. So until then, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day.